Hi, and uh, this demonstration is going to be a quick demonstration on how to use your new box. Um, thank you for purchasing the Cody Stream box, and we will jump right into it. So, uh, now that you've got your box turned on, what you're going to need to do is go over here to the settings options, click on settings, and we're going to need to connect your Wi Fi or your Ethernet depending on how you want to connect, if you want to use Wi-Fi, or if you're going to check mark Ethernet, just make sure that it is check marked and your connection is into the back of the box. Um, with Wi-Fi, you're going to need to find your own personal connection, click on it, and then you're going to need to enter your personal password and then click connect now. Once you are connected, uh, you will see that um, there is an IP address. Uh, let me get back there. Yeah, there's an IP address, uh, shows your connection name, and it says Wi-Fi connected. So once you see that, go ahead and on your remote control, click your home button, which is a little picture of a house, and that'll take you right back here to your main menu page, your home page. Um, now, in order to watch a movie or a television show, we're going to go into our media center, which uh, for those of you who have never used the box, um, it's going to be this icon down at the bottom, which is a blue K, which stands for Cody. Now, for some reason, if you're uh, not seeing this blue K or it's not there, um, It'll be inside of here where it says my apps and there it is there. Um, but most of you should have the blue K, which is right here. So let's click on that and this will uh, open up into your main menu for your media center coding. You can see here that the menu inside of Kodi uh, goes from left to right. You've got pictures. This is an area where you can eventually store personal pictures. Uh, you've got your videos, your music, programs, and system. Now, system and programs, you pretty much will never use. Um, music, this is where you can listen to all sorts of different music from all over the world. And videos is where you can find all your TV shows and movies. Now, what I've done below here, these are some favorites that your box should have come with. And uh, Genesis is the first one I put on here. For, for most of you that are new, um, best advice is uh, stay within Genesis. Um, until you feel you've kind of mastered it. Uh, some of the other add-ons, even the ones you see here, um, each add-on has different content. Uh, movies, TV shows. So um, they, they kind of have their own unique way about them. So it's um, when you're exploring those you, and you actually start to learn some of the different add-ons and know what's in them, uh, at that point, you'll you'll figure out which which ones are your favorites, and you can adjust these uh, however you want. And I'll have another video on how to do that. Um, <clears throat> now, if you were to hit video here up on your uh, menu, if you hit the add-ons, it's going to take you to where all of the add-ons uh, that are inside of your Kodi box are. So there, there's quite a bit. And like I said, each add-on serves a different purpose. Uh, this this add-on here and this add-on here, which is cloud and channel pair, this is live television. So, um, you know, if you wanted to watch live news, live TV, you can choose uh, one of these options. Now, uh, they're going to be options in uh, different languages. Um, so for those of you who speak Spanish, maybe some of you speak French. Um, if I were to click on cloud, I go to news. 
I'll get a list of news channels that'll appear and uh, it could be from all over the world, um, different news stations. Uh, first one, ABC News, it's in, tells me it's US, it's in English. Um, here's something in French, here's something in Spanish, Turkish, Hindi, uh, you know, just depending on what it is you want to watch. But this is actually live news, so if I were to click on it, uh, this is ABC News, you'll see here, this is live, I'll turn up my volume. Has its counterterrorism task force out here right now. Many of them are undercover. They assure us that this will be the safest place in the world. Tom, the crowd's growing by the second right to you. Thank you so much. The views hot topics are getting hot. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and close that out. I hit the stop button there. For those of you, I don't know if you caught that or not, but um, I hit the stop button and it took me right back out to this page. But this is uh, news stations and, and there's quite a bit of news stations in here. And uh, like I said, Spanish, Arabic, English, really just depends on what you're looking for. And um, I'm going to go ahead and hit the back button, which <clears throat> everyone has a back button on their remote control. And uh, you hit that, it'll just take you back to the previous screen that you were at. I'm going to hit it again. And here I'm outside of uh, where all my video add-ons are in. And here we have Genesis. This is Genesis is uh, um, the add-on that I, I think that you're going to find has 95% of the content that you want to watch. So let's go ahead and click on Genesis. And here we have movies, TV shows. So let's jump into TV shows. Now I can choose... TV shows um, many different categories. So it could be by year, genre, networks, people watching, most popular. Um, just, you know, however it is you want to find a TV show. Uh, at the very bottom here, if you want, you can just be very direct and do a direct search for a show. Um, if you want to just go to the most popular shows that are people are watching today uh, that's pretty much what I recommend I'll click most popular and you're gonna see a lot of shows that are currently uh, popular today uh, I know Walking Dead's popular Big Bang Theory Game of Thrones Supernatural Breaking Bad you know just just kind of depends on what you want to watch um, so in this case, uh, I'm just going to go ahead and pick one of these shows. Here's The Walking Dead. And it's going to give me all the different seasons that were available. And um, season six was the most current. So I can watch any episode I choose. Um, here's the last episode of The Walking Dead. So I've clicked on it, and now what it's doing is it's locating the different links that have this one episode on it. Um, there's going to be several links that have the same exact episode, which is looks like uh, episode 8 of season 6. So each link, even though it has the same episode in it, it's uh, different quality. So you've got HQ, which stands for high quality. And we can go down this list and we're going to find the next quality would be MQ. It's at the end of the uh, list here. You can see where it says MQ, which is medium quality. And then below that, we're going to go to low quality. Now, low quality is definitely... Um, a good way to find a stream that the quality will still be very good uh, however it will play much smoother anytime you're playing a media file you're requiring a lot of bandwidth from your internet and <clears throat> some of us may have real fast internet speeds that we pay for some of us might not we may have slower speeds um 
being connected to Wi-Fi can, can slow up your, your speeds as well. So for me, I, I do have high speed internet. I, I actually have a very high connection speed, um, but I still seem to choose the LQ quality um, just because I, I know that the media file is gonna play without any issues. And what I mean by issues would be like buffering, stuttering, getting hung up. Um, so just uh, maybe save you some trouble. LQ is a good place to start. Um, and under LQ, you'll see one that uh, comes up where it's called PrimeWire Best Streams. It's actually right here. So I'm gonna go ahead and click on that and play this episode of The Walking Dead. So we're gonna give it a, a few seconds and it will load that episode. Now, if for some reason it didn't play this particular episode um, and it wasn't available, it would be uh, the next link down would be my choice of, of what I would do, and, and that link hopefully would work. But if it didn't, Previously it would be the uh, link the below that. Dead. Let me turn this down. Oh my God. So, this is the episode that's being played right now. Uh, this is the last episode of the season. Um, this little menu on the bottom here looks very much like a dvd menu or vcr you've got rewind uh skip rewind i've got pause feature play we got stop fast forward skip forward so these buttons obviously you need to uh, be familiar with um this pause button here We'll pause it. Now, if you're ever having any sort of buffering or stuttering issues, that's exactly what you'd want to do is just pause it, give it a couple seconds. You'll see that it's buffering, it's getting ahead of itself, and then you would play it. Um, if you're done watching a movie and you, you're gonna leave the room, um, you would just hit the stop button and that'll actually close it out. Uh, to get rid of this screen, if you're going to actually watch this episode, you just hit the little back button one time on your remote control. I'm going to go ahead and do it. And it has that, that'll disappear, that screen. If I want that screen back up, I can go ahead and just click the OK button, which is uh, on your remote control. Just click it one time, and that will actually bring the screen back. So... Now that I have the screen back, I'm just going to hit the stop button because I'm not going to watch a whole show while I'm doing a video. And that'll stop it. And that's going to take us right back to where we came in. This is the list of links where we came in. Well, I'm going to use the back button on my remote control and hit it back once. And hit back again, again, back button again. Again, okay, this is where we came in, and I can go to movies, and in, under movies, I can go to most popular, essentially the same exact thing as we did with TV shows. And I can find a movie that I wanna watch, and click on it, it's gonna find the links, and uh, same thing, I can find the uh, low quality link, go to that and play it, so that is, pretty much it in a nutshell. So hopefully uh, this video was helpful and you can now watch a movie or TV show. And uh, like I said, stay in Genesis um, until you get familiar. So I'm going to sign off. Thanks so much. Good night.